Hello everyone, welcome to finally a second episode in the series and not the first. Alright, so let's get something to drink. Alright, so what we wanted to do was set up, uh, no one commented and told me where they want me to, to, to build at. So, I was thinking that we build both places. Alright, uh, I was thinking like maybe a shack right here. That way we got some water for aesthetic purposes and then um, I was thinking about building like maybe that be my house with bed and this up here be like a work area I don't know all right well we got some zombies to deal with first um, I need to make okay what's in my storage because I need to make some stuff all right Let's put this up. We'll cook the meat later. <clears throat> right now, I need to make... Alright. I need to make a new hatchet. I think I don't have... Yeah, I don't have one. Uh, actually... Alright. I Man. There he is. Alright, um, actually, I want to grab, let me grab this, uh, metal real quick. Alright, let's make a metal hatchet. Um, I guess we'll just attack him with this. I mean, it's a knife, so it should be decent. This should be, he should be going down soon. My goodness. Oh, wow, look. My finger is on the little touch down here. Man, that gets me in so much trouble sometimes. Come on, die. Die. Oh. This guy is invulnerable. I've le at least hit him over 25 times. I'm going to end up backing right into another zombie, I'm telling you. Alright, come on. Like, round. Thank you. Alright, so we got some... I'm uh, going to be saving up these skulls because if it is as many skulls... As you guys are telling me, uh, we have a lot of skulls together. Uh, we've got some leather starting to save up for some armor. Let's make a sledgehammer. The only bummer is you can't... And Oh, oh yes, I need a machete so bad. And a bow. That's going to be our first uh, ranged weapon. We're going to go ahead and make a bow. Um, wait, wait a minute, how much, nope, I took all the metal, so I don't have enough for a colt, and I'm not going to go ahead, we'll go ahead and make a bow, actually, I need to smelt this, and we might, we, we might as well go ahead and make the colt if we have it, right? Um, I'm, I'm assuming that you guys are like, yes, make the colt, bow and arrows to start, or a colt? Um, tough decisions, tough decisions. Alright, so I thought that I gathered up a bunch of meat. Oh yeah, I did, and it should be right here. Alright. Uh, no reason to cook that, we'll just keep that there. We'll take this charcoal though. Um, I don't know where that guy's at, but... I, su I expect to see him soon. Um, let's eat. Oh, I got some kind of uh, message. Or email. I just donated. 
a dollar to the game. Uh, I encourage you guys. I mean, I didn't donate five because for one, um, I just paid a bunch of bills on everything, and I literally have like two dollars left on my card. And I was just like, well, I'll just go ahead and donate uh, a dollar to the game because I mean, the game was free, and it's an excellent game, so it's definitely worth donating to. I, uh, I wish and uh, suggest everyone, uh, if you've got a dollar on a prepaid card or anything, just donate it to the game if you play all the time. Because, uh, I mean, you get the game for free, and they're still continuing to do updates. So uh, it just helps make the game better whenever there are funds for the game available. So. Alright, let's put this leather up. It's gonna take some leather. We're gonna we're not gonna just uh make a piece here and there. We're just gonna wait and save up until we can make a full set. Alright, got a sledgehammer made. Um, need a machete really bad. That way we have um some good melee weapon. And hopefully, uh, I will have plenty of metal uh, to make a pistol. That way, I can use the rest of the sulfur, my sulfur and the metal for um, bullets. However, because they consist of stone and wood, arrows are a smart choice in case we don't have any kind of guns so or any kind of ammo so I am going to make the bow you guys and I'm gonna have arrows because uh, truth be told we're not gonna be able to make a whole lot of ammo and we're also not gonna have um, a lot of ammo anyway with with everything added up to work with so we're going to need to make an alternative ammo source or weapon source long range. Um, let's go ahead and make, I don't need any more stone. So let's go ahead and make 15 arrows. That's, that's pretty good. That'll leave us with 15 stone. Uh, I need to get some more wood though while those are crafting and while my metal is smelting. Really glad that trees fall down now. Um, just looks a lot better, more realistic. There we go. And that way uh, you don't have to have. The, there's no more wood here and keep hitting it and hitting it uh, once it's gone it's gone that's the way it should be so I'm not playing online you guys like I said we are gonna build up stock up and prepare before we take off uh, on to any other islands that was the reason why I felt like I was so successful last time because, to be honest with you, I don't want to take anything less than MP to other players' islands because I want to always have the best gun whenever it comes to meeting another player. Um... Should we take out the bear? I mean, we do have a bow. Uh, we'll save. We've only got 15 arrows. Uh, we're just going to gather up just a little more wood, and then we'll head back. And uh, I'm going to have to, uh, basically, I'm going to have to gather up wood sooner or later and all these supplies, because that's the only way we're going to be able to advance so I might as well go ahead and try to get it knocked out of the way, you know. Let's go grab this fiber.
Make sure I'm getting it. All right. A hatchet does pretty good with fiber. When you get plus three fiber, um, that's pretty good. So you guys seem to really like this game. Um, do you guys... Uh, question, or the people that are watching this, let me know. Are you guys watching any of my other Let's Plays? Uh, comment. Let me know what let's plays you guys. Uh oh, look. Uh, um, comment. Let me know what let's plays you guys watch and which one's your favorite and why. Um, why do you like this game in general? What is it about uh, this game that just has you come back for more? Because you guys seem to uh, love this game compared to the other ones. And the only thing I can think of is. Is, is it really about multiplayer and zombies? Um, does the regular survival aspect not mean anything? Because, like, Ocean is Home is no multiplayer and no zombies. And it's pure, like, castaway survival. Which is my favorite. Ocean is Home is my favorite game. Uh, I would take it over any Android survival game. But that's just me. <clears throat> Alright. Let's get our medal. And let's see. All right, you guys, we are gonna make um, a pistol. Uh, you guys ready? Oh wow! You guys see what I see, right? Well, we're making the pistol because it's more efficient, and uh, I don't want to get greedy. I'm already using a lot of resources on that uh, I'm not going to be able to okay I love the knife but I've only got one I really don't want to I want to get rid of it so let's put the machete um, Let's take our sulfur. Alright, let's just go ahead and take this. I wish this would hurry up. Um, yeah, Alright, all right, let's just make whatever uh, gunpowder we can alright so we can make 20 bullets to start that's it's not too bad uh, we've got 15 arrows and 20 bullets so because we have ammo now and we are armed with a weapon um, fair is fair next episode I will be uh, starting online because I believe that I've got weapons. I even know it, the, the challenge is going to be me trying to get my house built and protect myself. But um, if I have, oh, if I have um, a weapon, then that to me is fair enough to where I should, uh, if I'm going to be online, then I should just go ahead and get online. What do you guys think? Um, it's going to be up to you guys. I need you guys to uh, let me know what you think. Uh, do you do you want me to get a little more prepared? Do you want me to go ahead and get online next episode? Uh, I'm waiting on you to let me know so that I can uh, make a decision off based off what you guys say. Because that's, like I said, at the end of the day, that's what I want to do, is what you guys want to do. Alright, so let's go ahead and put that back. We can make even more bullets. We can make 27, which is awesome. Um, go ahead and get this going. 
won't have enough metal. Actually, we'll, we'll be able to make... Yep, 27. It's going to take a couple minutes. Uh, wish that I would have made another um, inventory box. but oh, oh, let's take our three. So we're going to have 30 rounds all together. That is so awesome. Uh, we're already locked and loaded with, with weapons. And that's, that's, ladies and gentlemen, why... You always, at the very beginning, you just go wild and get as much resources as you can. <laughs> um, there is nothing uh, better than being able to, like, smell and get four or five hundred pieces of metal right off the bat because you just spent ten minutes, get fifteen minutes gathering up resources. I'm telling you guys, it's worth the time. The The time that you put in for resources is what's going to determine your success on this, le on, on, uh, on this game, if you play. I can promise you that. Because those, as you see, if you guys watched my playthrough, uh, you will definitely see um, I was more prepared than my opponent. Because to be honest with you, I don't even believe that some of them were, I believe some of them had like, like for instance, I think one, like one or two of the guys picked up the uh, poopy pistol in front of that zombie thing and didn't even have any ammo and just held it there to try to intimidate me and probably didn't have any kind of, uh, any kind of ammo whatsoever and wasn't even a threat so I'm I'm literally like thinking that that was why uh, some of them were easy was because they were uh, playing unprepared that's what I'll say so let's go get some more wood we really need to uh, I need to find out what's the use of toadstool because it poisons me or something whenever I eat it so it has no health uh, uh, eating benefit so I don't really know what's the the purpose of it is it, it may be for fish traps <clears throat> because I think there are fish traps on here now um, Mr. Boar looks like he wants to be slain with my machete but uh, I'll let him be. I don't want to die. I've already taken some damage. So I really don't want to get in any kind of fights right now. We're just going to gather up as much wood as we can with this hatchet. We'll gather all of these trees until it breaks. And then we'll go ahead and head back. Um, I need to make, do I have enough room? Okay, I need to make another inventory box. And um, that's going to take 30 wood off of me, so I need to replace that. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys, my throat was just, felt like it was clogged up. So I was playing basketball a couple hours ago, and I literally heard a snap in my ankle when I went up and... My ankle is literally wrapped up and on ice, and it hurts so bad. Um, I thought that I broke it, but I don't. I didn't break it, but I think I may have um, a hairline fracture. And if that's the case, it's gonna suck because it could break if I end up putting too much weight on it. All right, uh, let's just put. Oh. Just put that there. All right, let's get back, you guys. Uh, we've got enough wood just to mess around with this episode, at least. So, I'm going to go ahead and start a uh, foundation on a new house. I really would like to do a multi-story house, but uh, I'm not sure on how good it's going to be to be 
building multi-story houses on this game, but we are going to try, you guys. Um, I kind of just wanted to wait and see where you guys wanted me to set up at, but um, no one's really commenting and uh, letting me know exactly where I should be setting up. So we got 30 rounds for the uh, Colt, which is really cool. We need to, you know what, that's what we're going to do right now, you guys. We are going to go, uh, first off, we're going to go collect all the rocks, or all the stone that we can and stuff, and ores. And then second off, we will be, uh, let me go ahead and just put that there. We are going to be looking for some kind of uh, water bottles, because I cannot go with uh, one water bottle that long that's not very I cannot go to another person's island without at least 10 that's my rule because if you go and something happens to where you need water and you're out of water and you and if I died on someone else's island I would be just so mad alright so we don't need all this food I want to save these save these berries uh, we'll obviously have to take our water because that's the only bottle. Put the rope up, put the fiber up, and put the stone and wood and metal up. Uh, we will keep the ammo. I don't want to get rid of it. We'll just, there we go. And the only thing I forgot I got to do real quick is make a... Um, Another hatchet. There we go. Alright, now let's put this stuff up. Alright, so we still got a hundred metal left over. Uh, we need some more. Oh my gosh. That scared the crap out of me. Um, I was not expecting that. Okay, we're raining. But I messaged them. I, yeah, I sent them a long email. <clears throat> Um, I said that, you know, like, oh, wow, leather, oh my goodness, you guys, a bigger backpack, I forgot all about that, okay, so we need to, that's what we're saving up, the leather, and, uh, oh, right, we're saving up for that, that is awesome, but, um, I messaged them, and I was like, so, Basically, you guys put weather in and storming, but you guys don't have a temperature bar, so I'm standing out in the rain, and it does not matter. And that, to me, is not realistic. So I would like to see something changed with that. Um, let's go... Let me put this metal hatchet... Let's go. Should we go ahead and lock it, lock and load? Now, let's get the bow out. No, let's get the machete out. Because you never know what we're going to need. Um, berries, definitely going to be getting these. I love berries. They're my, one of my favorite foods. Because they restore food and uh, water. Just like mushrooms, but I just don't like mushrooms. I think they look stupid. The bit red is my favorite color ever since I could remember. I mean, literally, the one thing that has not changed about me is that um, my favorite color is red. I literally have liked red. Die Hard, uh, no other color <clears throat> besides red ever since I could literally like remember that I've been alive. And it's been always, and it still has been, like, a hardcore passion for the color red. And I know that sounds crazy, but it's like, I would do everything red. I had a S10, and it was, like, perfect red. Like, the perfect shade. Like, candy, not, maybe candy apple. Something like that. But it was just a nice, bright type of red. How much... So, what do you think, guys think about taking Mr. Rabbit out? Try, I was just wanting to test out my machete. So, what do you got for me? Because we need, see, this is why. 
I mean, you get three pieces of fat, we get a piece of cloth, two pieces of cloth, and a piece of meat. Um, they're just too good to pass up on. They're one hit, and then you get a decent amount of resources off of them, and it just helps us build up for the, I mean, look at that, five fat. Um, helps us build up to get that bigger backpack. That's a must uh, as soon as possible. So that we can carry uh, all kinds of uh, resources, a lot more resources uh, back to base. So that's why uh, it's a it's a must right as soon as possible. Um, we are definitely going to take out all of these deer now that we have a machete. I'm not going to shoot them. That's just a waste. First off, if that is oh, look at this, you guys. This is what I was talking about. Water bottles. This is what I need. This is awesome. Uh, canned food. Just definitely uh, needed. Um, I don't want to eat those. I kind of want to just save them up. I uh, really would like not to eat those. Also want to save some coconut as well. Because if I'm not mistaken, they uh, they give you water as well. They should, and uh, the, the the stuff that restores both, I like to save them because um, you never know when you're gonna need those kinds of things. And if I don't have to, I don't want to waste them. And th those. Like, berries to me are so important because they could literally save your life. Oh, what am I doing? Alright, it's really easy with the machete. I'm just going to go take them all out first. Come on, buddy. Alright, did I get them all? Alright, I'll go down there and get you. I'm heading that way. Anyway, that way we can... I mean, look at this, you guys. We're already going to have enough cloth. I should pick up enough fiber. And we're also going to have a lot more meat. So we can be... Uh, a lot more calm about getting food we're gonna have enough hopefully to build um, that backpack soon I'm just gonna need 16 more leather but I've got the cloth I'm gonna go ahead and bypass getting health right now All right, we already got that one All right, I, did I miss one I don't think I did, but I just want to make sure because it would be a real shame to to waste uh, resources. All right, I'm good. All right, so let's take out these two. This well, this stag right here. All right. I mean, we've got a good amount of food, which. Um, like, a, like you guys know me, if you've watched my Let's Plays, I love stocking up and I love having uh, a lot of supplies before I do any kind of multiplayer. I mean, look at that. 30 cloth and 50 fat already. And going to get some more coconuts and more wood. I mean, we're doing awesome for being uh, on episode 2. So, this is really exciting, I won't lie. Because um, we are going to focus on shelter building soon. Uh, if that's wood, I'm not worried about going back to the house. Um, I'm just going to fall asleep wherever. I'm going to get this wood, get these coconuts. These resources are more important to me right now to gather up. <clears throat> and we're also going to take out these crabs. And we're just going to 
go as go as long as we've got the the energy. Let's gather this fiber. That's for sure. I wonder if you can gather fiber yet with this. Yeah, they, that's just crazy. You should be able to. That's the thing that should give you the most fiber. I'm running out of energy, you guys. I'm sorry. Um... I don't want to use go back and use my coffee. Uh, there, there, there needs to be a change there. They need to change it so that you don't have to log out. That's that's like saying we don't want you to play our game. Um, just, I think it's because they want you to obviously buy um, like coffees and stuff. Or uh, watch videos at least. And that's. I mean I get it. If that's the way he's making. Or they, they are making money. Then I mean. Hey I, I get it. Because I mean other than me donating. I didn't pay for the game. And neither did anyone else. Unless they donated. And that's still not paying for the game. It's just donating. So I mean. Look at this, you guys. We're getting some coconuts. We're getting wood. We are getting meat. It's been an all-around excellent uh, episode. Very, very productive. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, let me know. Like I said, let's be more interactive. If, uh, if you guys let me know stuff that, that I'm asking, uh, it helps... Uh, me do the things that you want me to do in the let's play so what do you tell me what you think about the um, like building the workshop area up there or should I build all up there or all down there or how should I do it just let me know really love uh, your comments and uh, being interactive we're going to save here probably as soon as we gather up these coconuts because we are passing out. I'll be lucky if I can get these coconuts. Alright, all right, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and save it. It was uh, very fun and I will see you guys next time.